Hey everyone, to get started today, you're gonna need a pencil, probably a Sharpie or a black marker of some sort, and some color pencils. Now, once you have those tools, make sure you get a fresh sheet of white paper, and we'll teach you how to make these cool dude dogs. Hey everyone, today we are going to be making a sunglass cool dog, I guess I'm going to call them. So getting started, we're going to start in the middle of our paper and I'm going to draw and then Bam's going to draw. So start with like a little less than oval shape for nose. And then I'm going to sketch in two lines, kind of curvy lines, going to be the upper part of the nose. Nice. Now we decided beforehand we're going to do sunglasses, so make the arch above the nose. And then your shape of your sunglasses. So if you want circle sunglasses, make circles. If you want it to be more rectangle, that's what I'm going to make, more rectangular. some sunglasses okay so now I put on some eyebrows above so I just put some arches you could also put some straight lines if you're making your dog think um, and then I'm gonna put on part of the head so it's kind of a down arch, above arch for the part of the top of the head. And then I'm gonna put some ears. So my ears are spotty dog. His ears are kind of short. So I'm gonna make it kind of a triangle shape, but it's gonna have a dip kind of a little bit down here and go around for his ear. He kind of has a little bit of a sometimes crease there. Now I'll make one on the other side too. So I'm gonna look again. Kind of a triangle shape coming down to a point. A crease in the middle. Now we're gonna start making the bottom side of his face. His face is gonna kind of come in triangular. So if it goes behind your sunglasses, a little bit, it will, and that's okay. So it's gonna kind of come down, go across. Uh, it's not a triangle with a point, it's just kind of triangular. It doesn't have quite a square chin, so we'll make it a little more pointy. This could be as could be his mouth right there, couldn't it, if I make an extra line right there? I don't know about you, but sometimes our spotty dog has his tongue hanging out too, especially when he's on a cool dog walk, so maybe we'll put his tongue coming out. You don't have to put that if you don't want to. <laughs> right? Okay, so then... Shoulders. His shoulders are going to curve. 
curve down so this one's gonna kind of come behind here they're gonna curve kind of an, like an oval shape and then you got a line that kind of curves on the inside that's gonna show us little arm muscles Now this part is going to kind of curve out, curve around for a stinky on oops, each side. So I'm going to go back over here and the curve out is pinky. And then I'm going to kind of make a curve this way. That's going to make another foot or another part of his paw. Make so that we have four of those total. Yep, connect that one there. There you go. Good job. Then I'm going to do that again on the other side. So, curve it around. And then curve it around. Curve it around. And the last one curves around and makes the rest of his foot. So, you should have four toes. Kind of one round one. The other three are overlapping so you don't see the whole. Oh, pretty good. Now we'll connect his belly with a smile kind of shape or half bottom of a oval or circle. Now you could just leave your dog there if his body is behind. If his body is off to the side, you could curve it down. You could do that on either side, whichever side you want. I'm going to have mine come down here. And then I'm going to have his back foot coming around. If you want, you can put the paws again. A little more hidden, this one. And then his tail. Good job. So I'm just going to draw his up a little bit more. Perfect. Awesome. So I'm just going to straighten yours out. Looks great. So there's the start. Now I'm going to pause this and we're going to speed lapse uh, of our tracing and adding a few bits of color. Thank mm -hmm. you. 